What's up ladies and gentlemen? Welcome to my channel. So right off the bat I'd like to say please excuse the headphones, I am using it as a microphone at the moment. I'm saving up for one. Um, but for now I'm saving up for the car, so I'm to tell my money is going towards that. So within the next few months I will definitely have a mic. This will have to make do for now. Uh, let's get straight into it. I don't want to waste any more of your time. How to start your self-improvement journey? What are the things, the tips you need to know? Damn, it sounds so lackluster, man. You get a bit more excited. You get, you get hyped up. So, number one, man. First tip I can give you guys is you need to plan what you're going to do. See a goal without a set-out plan. It's just a wish. I can't remember where I did that, but that is a good point. You need to know why you are doing what you're doing. You need a reason behind it. Secondly, you need to know how you're going to get to where you want to be. Make a little list of things you want to achieve. And set out to do those things. Easy as that. You can make small little goals small little milestones that you want to reach and once you start hitting those man it's going to give you confidence to keep on going to reach new heights take it to further extremes you know what i mean um excuse me this helped me a lot personally um let me show you guys something Oh, by the way, this is my POA, this is my plan of action. I carry this basically everywhere I go. Um, it has my year planned out, all the goals I want to reach, and as well as things I would like to have um, that I'm working towards getting. This is my to-do list for this month achieved for the month. And looking at it right now, we're in the middle of January, or no, nearing the end of January, and I've just about completed everything they used to do. One of the goals was to start my own YouTube channel, and I guess I can cross all that off the list now. So I got that confidence behind me to keep going, because I have proof of what I did. I have something to fall back on, to, to show me that, okay, I've put in the work, and that's going to give me a bit of extra confidence to just keep on going, because I've come this far. Why not take it all the way? You understand? Alright, man. Point number two is to focus on yourself. You can't expect to level up. Level up with whatever you, you're busy with if you're not taking time out of your day to just focus on yourself. Forget about the naysayers, forget about the haters, forget about all external factors. Just focus on you. Take time out, do what's best for you. Because in the end, man, all you have is yourself. You came in this world by yourself, and you're going to leave it by yourself. So make sure whatever you got going, man, that it's good. Point number three. This is really good to you. Um, I'll let it hunt. Point number three. Hold yourself accountable. You need to be responsible for your actions. If no one's gonna hold, if you're not gonna hold yourself accountable, no one will. And what I mean by holding yourself accountable is, if you needed to do something, if you had a goal to achieve, something to set out, and you didn't achieve it, and you're just allowing yourself to, you know, forget about what what it is you've done, you're not taking action on the wrong you've done. You're not improving. You're staying the same, you're being complacent, you are allowing yourself to slip. And to me that's a big no-no, you know. You gotta you gotta hold yourself accountable. You gotta put pressure on yourself to achieve what it is you want to achieve. And holding yourself accountable makes you responsible. It allows you to have confidence in yourself because you know that you're gonna get it done. Because you hold yourself accountable. You are responsible for your own actions and you know that. Keep pushing through, my guy losing through this list now. 
point number five is going to be understanding that things take time. If you're on the journey of self-discovery or self-improvement, you want to learn how to increase your confidence, uh, maybe you're striving towards a goal in your car like I am, or you want to move out of your parents' house, understand that it's going to take a while. Okay, nothing's going to happen overnight. I wish that was the case. And the journey is going to be a hard one. If it was easy, everybody would be doing it against that. So use that to your advantage, the fact that it's going to be a difficult journey. Don't allow yourself to fall under the immense pressure that you put on yourself, if that makes any sense. Understand that this is a journey. Like you got to take it day by day, step by step. Nothing's going to happen immediately. Just make sure you get what you set out to get, okay? And what I mean by that is put yourself in a position where you will succeed. Put in the hard work and you reap the benefits. You got to be consistent with this though. You got to keep on doing it. Nothing happens overnight. Dome no wasn't built in one day. You understand? So go out there, put in the work, stay consistent, and believe that what you set out to achieve will be achieved. Those are five points I gave you guys. Use them to your advantage. If you need anything else, I'll always be putting up more videos. If you have any video ideas, feel free to hit me up, you know. Everything in my channel description. If you wanna find me, it'll be there. Um a bonus tip for those that stick it on to this late of the video. I'm very thankful that you have. If you resonated with the video, you know, leave a like, subscribe. If you want this to reach more people, please share. Feel free to share. I'll always be appreciative of that. Uh, here's a bonus tip for you guys though. Most important thing I can give you is don't be too hard on yourself. Allow things to come as they come. Okay. This leads into previous point, understanding that things take time. So put in the work and after you earn what you earn, enjoy it, you know. Life's an experience, you're here to experience life. So what's the point in being unhappy? Go out, do what makes you happy. And yeah, man, this is only the beginning. I look forward to the journey. Cheers. Keep the pace, I'm on the chase for the paper. I'm that freaky, freaky, freak of nature. This is in my nature. I've been rapping and adapting, pimp slapping. I'm a pimp. All these bitches think they sharks, but these bitches really shrimp. So I eat them, sip champagne. This my story, my campaign. I'ma tell it how I want. Storyteller, pussy dweller. I'ma dwell. It's not heaven till you've been to hell. Oh well, go to hell and back and get.